Hello and welcome back to Farmer's Life Homestead. I'm Stacey. It was requested in my last video um, if I could show you how to make golden syrup. So I'm going to show you that now. It's quick and easy to make and it's all you need is sugar, water and um, a lemon basically. And then you can make your own golden syrup and it's shelf stable and it is really cheap to make. Alright, the first thing you need is four tablespoons of water to go into the pot. That's four. And we need 100 grams of sugar. You could make it with um, raw. I, I haven't, but I'm sure it wouldn't, wouldn't matter. It's just over. That's fine. And then we're popping that into the pot. We're going to want this to, um, that's going to make the caramel colour. So I'm just going to give it a quick stir to dissolve. Okay, and then I'm going to leave it alone. Sorry if you can hear the dishwasher in the background, it's just about finished. So it's on high heat at the moment and as I said this is going to be what makes the colour you know basically it's a caramel now I'm going to bring it down to a medium heat Just give it a And we're just going to wait until it develops a, a caramel colour. Right, you can just see the colour is starting to change. And just give it a, a slight swirl. Um, and we don't want to burn it, we just want a caramel colour. basically the hard crack stage. Right, that's just slightly taking it off the heat. As I said, you don't want to burn it at this stage. Right, now I have, while this was happening, I boiled the jug and now I'm going to put in 300 grams of boiling water and I'm just going to add that slowly and stir. Just watch out, it is going to spit at you. beautiful deep colour. Okay now we're going to add half a kilo of sugar. I'm just going to stir this in until it's dissolved. Now I'm going to add three slices of lemon and I've just taken the seeds out. And what the lemon does is um, it stops it from caramelizing anymore and it stops the sugar from crystallize, crystallizing. Oh, I've got a pip in that one. Oops. Okay, so I can see all that sugar is dissolved now. I'm just going to bring it back up to heat. And don't worry about any little bits floating around. We're going to strain that before we um, 
jar it. In the meantime, you need to sterilize the jar and make sure that it's hot um, to take the syrup. Okay, now I'm just going to turn that right on the lower setting now. And it will just simmer away. That's about where you want it. Um, you know, between about 45 minutes it can be a little bit sooner, but just keep an eye on it. So, I just, um, we're coming up to 40, uh, 45 minutes. So, I've just grabbed a little bit from the pot. And as you can see, this sort of, I, I just dropped it in the droplet. It's just stayed, and then if you look, it's quite, quite thick. So that's what you're looking for. Is once it's sort of, as I said, it, once it, it'll uh, thicken up once it starts to cool as well. So that's ready. Just to cool off slightly um, before I go and put it in the jar. So yeah, because that's just too super hot. So. I will just let that cool for maybe a good 15, 15 minutes. I'm just going to grab out uh, my hot jar. Okay, so this has just come out of the dishwasher. Um, and I need just to get my strainer. We'll just pick up the lemons. A mess. Now I'm not going to put the lid on just yet, I'm going to let it cool for a while, um, otherwise you'll get condensation and that will ruin your mixture. So just leave it like that until it's cooler and then you can pop your lid on, I've just got a one piece lid. Um, but you can use a two piece if you like. Um, I've got a little bit left over in the pot, so I'm just going to have to sterilise another jar. Um, and um, I usually use the the 750 ml jar, which is perfect for that recipe. So yeah, use a 750 ml, or um, or get yourself two pint jars. Um, so yeah, look at that beautiful colour. Um, I probably could have taken the caramel just a little bit further. Um, but you know that's still quite golden um, yeah so thanks so much for joining me today and um, seeing just how easy it is to make your own gold, golden syrup um, of course golden syrup is um, is a good old um, kiwi staple really so knowing how to make it yourself is, is good because as I said it's very very cheap to make when all you need is sugar a little bit of lemon and um, water so um, do give it a go it will sit in your pantry for um, for a few months at least um, because it's you know high in sugar and it's you know you pretty much preserved it so thanks again for joining me and um, it's always great to see you um, and um, I look forward to seeing you again on the next video. Alright, bye for now.